Welcome back to The Witcher Enhanced Edition. We are here in the swamp looking for the Salamandra Gang. There are apparently three locations where they're hiding. Uh, in the caves, uh, near the druids, and I think near the, the fallen tower as well. I thought these guys got killed. The brickmakers. Uh, there is a shrine down here as well, which I've never figured out what to do with. Um, at night time, I have seen some creature coming up to this shrine, so I think I'm supposed to put something there, but I'm not sure uh, what it is at the moment. Nothing to do. more drowners to deal with. Actually, we got a quest, didn't we, from Vaska in the last episode. Um, what was that quest? Um, I can't remember. I'm sure I'll figure it out along the way. I think she did give us a quest to, uh, to kill more drowners. I don't know if it's these ones here. Um, some pretty specky moves by Geralt there, doing a backflip um, and a sword strike at the same time. Let's just go and grab a few of these herbs as well. Oh, there's a, a Kikamore over there. I don't actually have the book uh, for those creatures. I'm not exactly sure where I need to buy it from either, but hopefully the Druids have uh, some books for me and... Um, yeah, so I may head off to the Druids, Druids area first before I start taking on those, uh, those creatures. The Lumberjacks camp. Oh, it's the Lumberjacks camp. I think they all got killed. We're gonna go and find out. But uh, in the meantime, let's head down to the cave. We should be able to take out the salamandra. Okay, so we do get uh, increased sign intensity by 100%. I don't know if they're inside the cave. They probably are. I saw a fire here. Okay, silver signet ring. Let's just go and grab the Orin and the Nilfgaardian lemon as well. I uh, won't worry about anything else. Um, it could be a fairly difficult fight in here. Let's quickly save the game just in case. And I don't often use the, the blade coatings. Uh, let's have a quick look. Is there anything we can... Uh, put on the blade. Or oh, the cat potion. I don't know how dark it is down there. It's probably pretty dark. 
I thought I kept so kept something for my uh, for the blade coating, but I must have put it all away. Oh, never mind. I will grab a um. Uh, why can't I use this uh, the sugar doll? Oh, there we go. Okay, so that should help out uh, a little bit. Let's head inside the cave, see if we can take out the Salamandra gang. Oh, it's not too dark. There's a lot of people over there. That only gives five minutes of regeneration. Holy moly, okay. I'm gonna need the other strong here. I'll make you squeal. Okay. Who's this little kid? There's a little boy there. Um, two down. A few more to go. Let's see what kind of loot they've got. We're just going to go and grab uh, all of that. There's a little boy following me around now. The messenger of the lords lifts me from my knees and tears off my chains. Are you the brickmaker's lost child? I sat on foreign shores, crying and remembering my fatherland. So neither druids nor dryads kidnapped you. Blessed be he who wields a sword against my enemies. Okay. Hurry home. Who is above the lords? Right. I'll be going. Okay, so we've rescued the uh, the lost lamb, the little boy there. And uh, we need to go back to Vasca. I think there was a reward associated with that as well. Hopefully we can draw out these, these guys little by little. Oh, they're the brickmakers down here. saved at last no I came on my own you're free hear that everyone we're going home before you go tell me what you know about salamandra they held us at a camp one group may be by the old logging area thank you okay that was actually a lot easier uh, than I expected let's just go and grab uh, some candy here as well um, it was very dark in here where is my torch Okay. Is it worth checking the rest of the cave? It's probably just the same as it was before. It doesn't look like there's any uh, anything else here. The map seems to have refreshed itself, so let's just head down quickly. I may as well grab these mushrooms while I'm here. Cockatrice is here. Holy moly. If you can avoid being poisoned by these cockatrices, they're actually... No, it's the wivens we saw before in the in the swamp, and uh, we've got a cockatrice uh, feather. Can I carry any more items? I've got too many of these things. The wine stone contains rebus. What does this contain? Ever. I'm not sure what is most 
valuable, actually. Well, I've got a lot of Rebus, so... Let's just drop the Winestone, I guess, and grab that one instead. I was assuming there was enough space for all of the alchemical ingredients, but obviously not. Um, okay. So I'm just going to continue making my way around and see what else we can find. The logger area should be just, yeah, it's just up ahead, the Lumberjacks camp. So I think there's going to be another another battle with the Salamandra there. Okay, I see a fire going out off in the distance. What is that? There's somebody over here. Okay, we are going to have to take them out. Um, one, two, three. Looks like there's three guards to take out. That should not be too difficult to do. Not three or four. Oh, mate, you screw. They are standing back a bit. They don't want to get... They lost their weapon. That's interesting, they don't pick up their weapons when they, um, when they lose them. Thanks be to the Lords. You're free. We wish to reward you. What is Salamandra doing in the swamp? They're based at the former non-humans camp. You'd need an army to drive them out. Thanks, I'll remember that. Okay, so this is obviously just a few of the Salamandra. Their main camp is where the Scoyotel were. Um, where they had their training camp. I want to go and see the Druids first of all. Let's go and grab some beggar tick here. Um, there should be a few more remains. What's this trunk doing up here? I haven't seen this before. Diamond dust, some orange, and there's a rusty sword. I don't want that, but I missed that. I uh, missed that trunk the first time around. And uh, we're going to continue up to the druid's um, place. See if there's anything different there. So it's still quite a large area, mostly the same as in Chapter 2, but... 
few more salamandra corpse Tamarian iron axe see if we can get any information about what's been going on here so there's still some unknown herbs that we need to get more information about there's a fireplace there I may be able to rest and, and heal up what is the time 7.30 Let's wait. Let's let's finish this quest, and then uh, I'll rest somewhere, and hopefully we have a few more talents that we get to spend. The circle of power mm. renders the soil fertile. In wed streda kemu in ker. In wed streda kemu in kerme. Yevan, Yevan. Kedmail Wolf, a pleasure to see you. How's everything with you? We suffocate in the shackles placed upon us by our human oppressors. I'm not one of your zealots, Yavin. Spare me. I jest, though there's truth in what I say. But we defeated the Order in the swamp and are gradually emerging from the forests. You don't stand a chance in open battle. We shall see. But we will not back down now. What are you doing here? Why aren't you with your elves? The Druid's Grove acts as a sanctuary where I can quietly think, lay plans. My going to Vizima presents an unnecessary risk. Part of the unit inside Vizima is accomplishing plenty. Have any jobs for me? I have a mission for you. One not entirely related to the struggle for freedom. Yavin cut to the chase. We have learned that the ruins of an elven temple have been found in the sewers beneath Vizima. Not surprising, given the city was erected on elven foundations. We think Lara Dora may have been there, and may have left something behind. Who? You will learn everything if you agree to help. I sent a unit there, but I fear something has gone wrong. I need you to find out what happened. I'll see what I can do. Wonderful. I'd be interested to hear about Lara. Lara Doran. Ep Sheardal was an elven sorceress. An N7. A knowing one. She carried Hen Ikir. Elder blood. Which puzzles even us elves. As fate would have it, Lara fell in love with a human sorcerer. Kregenon of Lod. Other humans could not bear it, and began persecuting them. They became outcasts, shunned by all around them. No pleas would soften the stone hearts of the cruel and merciless Duan. When Lara, begging mercy not for her but for her unborn child, grabbed the door of the royal carriage, at the king's behest a man-at-arms lashed out with his cutlass, severing her fingers. She fled the city, sought shelter in a forest. When night descended and the frosts came, Lara faded on a hill amidst the trees. She gave birth to a daughter whom she protected with what warmth remained in her waning body. Though a blizzard raged through the night, spring suddenly appeared on that hill, and Fenewed bloomed. Now those flowers grow only in Dol Blathana, and where Lara breathed her last. You must understand the importance of any artifacts. She was exceptional, someone whose loss defies words no matter what the language. Why do you hate humans so much, Yavin? <laughs> Why? I assume you don't mean ideology and the like, and you would rather hear some dark secret from deep within my soul. You assume correctly. I'll answer your question if you answer mine. Agreed. I once lived in a city among humans. I was honest and courteous, respected all their ridiculous customs and laws. Assimilation. I lived that word for years, and during that time I was cheated, sneered at, on occasion beaten and robbed. I felt no hatred for humans, in fact, I felt better than them. I told myself they were simply incapable of controlling their weaknesses, their flaws. I was robbed three times as often as others. Racist slogans were painted on my door in excrement. For years I wondered why. Was I doing something wrong? What could I do to bring peace to my life? And you know what I came to understand? No, but I'm sure you'll tell me. I was doing nothing wrong. 
I'd been lying to myself from the outset. Just as the moon will never catch the sun, so humans will never change. They will remain egotistical, envious, petty, and fearful of anything they don't understand. And believe me, there's plenty. Matters proceeded quickly thereafter, but that's another story. Now you resemble humans. No, Geralt, definitely not. And you, Witcher? Who are you? You too have experienced human ignorance and hatred. Um, hmm. To me, elves hardly different from humans. Uh, I'm as much as an outcast as you, Yaven. I see your point, but I have no interest in torturing human villagers. I'm as much an outcast as you, Yaven. I see your point, but have no interest in torturing human villagers. I'm glad you understand, White Wolf. Farewell. Oh, we've been given a key to the uh, the additional location. Now there is somebody else here. There's that that woman. Isn't there a, an elder? Oh, there's a hierophant here, and an elder druid as well. Welcome. Greetings. Do my eyes play tricks? Is it Geralt, the famed White Wolf? Indeed. How do you know me? I've heard about you from our friend, Mousesack. I lost my memory and don't remember Mousesack. A pity. Perhaps I can help, if you stay for a few years. I must attend to urgent matters. Yes. Oh, that's right, yes. And we need to ask about the, uh, the werewolf. I come on behalf of a woman whose beloved transforms into a werewolf. She wishes to find a cure. You're a witcher. You should know how to treat lycanthropy. I may have known once, but I can no longer recall the method. I know several cures for lycanthropy, though I've not put any to the test myself. What of a magical cure? An elixir? <laughs> I know not how to prepare one. You should question an experienced alchemist. I have heard a shirt made with fool's parsley may help. Really? Yes. Gather five leaves of fool's parsley and tell the woman to weave them into a shirt. Then her lover should wear it for the night. Thanks for the advice. There is also one folk remedy. I'm embarrassed to mention it, but it is said Pure, unconditional love changes beasts into men. I'll remember that, too. Remember this. Lycanthropy is a disease that penetrates ever deeper. Before endeavoring to remove the curse, you must make sure the werewolf is still a man at heart. Why? If he is not, he'll continue the slaughter, even once cured. Remain nothing more than a monster. I see. I'll try to learn the werewolf's identity. Yes. We have mutual friends? You might say so. My former poker partner, Mouse Sack, mentioned you. It has been a while since we last met. I play. So we might sit down to a game sometime. We could indeed play. They say you're clever. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, so we can... She get Carmen to reveal the werewolf's identity. She went back to the temple quarter. I haven't finished speaking with the the hierophant here. Yes. Um, we can play with him. What do you think of the Scoyotail? What do you think of the Scoyotail? I'm uninterested in political conflicts. The druids prevail because we possess nothing that kings covet. They, in turn, know we pose no threat to their power. They may disapprove of you sheltering Scoyotail. We help all those in need as long as they respect our customs. The elves respect and understand nature. And humans do not. Not all, sadly. Rivers near cities are befouled with waste. 
Once great forests are logged without restraint. Animals that once thrived have become scarce. I see. Yes. Okay, let's see if we can beat him at a game of uh, dice poker. We may as well bet 40 here. I've got a little bit of, um, quite a few orange. Let's uh, roll the dice. Uh, it's not a bad roll. Triple fives. If we can get another lucky roll here, it's going to be a quick game. Uh, full house. <laughs> Oh, he almost got a full house as well, but uh, we've got a better full house with sixes and threes. All right, let's bet 60. We won the game. Beautiful. A few extra orange always comes in handy. Uh, now, there was the Elder Druid. Time to pray. Let's grab the, the Bally's here. There was an Elder Druid. There we go. Over here. What is it? I want to buy some books. Oh, 600. Oh, good grief. I'm going to leave that one for now. It's really expensive. And I do want more information about the monsters rather than the, the herbs. Okay, let's head off to the, uh, the Collapse Tower. Uh, carry on with our quest. To, uh, to defeat the Salamandra. I heard I heard a wolf chasing me, but uh, obviously it was just the game. <laughs> the game sounds. Um, just some odd sound effects there. Okay, let's head across. This is the wrong direction, isn't it? Can I jump down? No. Alright, that's definitely... Okay, let's go and grab uh, all of the remains. There's uh, a few. I think there's one more over here somewhere. Okay, beautiful. Okay, so this is the collapsed tower. This should be where the. I think there's a third camp over here somewhere. There's supposed to be a third camp over here somewhere, unless I read the quest wrong. Otherwise, the main camp is back with the Scoia Tail. Oh, here we go. Okay, yeah, there is. There is another camp over here. Let's go and uh, deal with them. I'll make you squeal. Is it the group? Yes, yeah, it's the group. Uh, I think it's the group attack that makes them lose their weapons. Can I get this guy to, to drop his weapon?
Yeah, using group attack on these larger opponents makes them lose their weapons. So that is that is pretty cool. Let's just go and grab got a Salamandra badge there. Oh, I've got a ring as well. Oops. Trying to see if I can make him uh, drop his weapon. No, I'll never mind. Just in time. Return home. May you never suffer drought. What do you know about Salamandra? They forced us to gather herbs, make fistic. One group hides in the cave near the old logging area. Salamandra is involved in the drug trade? Thanks. Return home. We need to talk to the liberated brick makers. We need to talk to uh, Vasca. Uh, a lot of people we need to talk to. Let's go and grab the beggar tick. There's another trunk here as well. Aha! Uh -huh. oh, I've already read it on swamp plants. I want to grab that because I may be able to sell it uh, to somebody else as well. What I might do actually is... Um, is there a fireplace around here? There is. Let's chill out for a little bit before we go to the main camp and just rest up a bit. We've got some new talents here and uh, we can beef up our... How long do I want to meditate for? I don't feel like I need any more potions right now, but let's see if there's anything new that we can make that may be interesting. Causes crippling pain to wounded creatures. Argenti Ar Argentia. Poisons wounded opponents. I don't feel like these opponents are strong enough to have to worry about poisoning them. Um, we could make another swallow potion. Gonna make another one of those. White honey could be a, a something pretty handy to have. Immediately restores some lost vitality. The white rapids decoction. Okay, we'll mix up one of those as well. And we've got three bronze talents, one silver talent. I may as well just start with strength here. We've got... It's not often that we have less than 25% vitality. That's a pretty a pretty bad battle if that happens. So, uh, dexterity. Midnight to dawn, attack and dodge plus 50%. Plus 10 Or do I have Predator already? It's not uh, not blue like the other the other tokens there. Uh, fist fight. Yeah, we do have a silver token that we can use. Um, plus two vitality, otherwise knockdown resistance. We've also got stone skin aggression damage plus ten percent. Hmm. I may just go with aggression, damage plus 10%. That's going to be the, uh, the silver talent there. Or maybe I should have... Oh, I should have gone for uh, for strength. Oh no, that's a gold talent, isn't it? We don't have gold talents yet. Okay, let's have a look here at uh, intelligence. Uh, the bomb preparation is needed to uh, produce bombs. So, I'm not really worrying about that uh, at the moment. Okay, ah, the knockdown plus 25%. Uh, we've got Igni, the fire sign. I've got all of those already. Uh, Quen, we haven't used that much. Now, Quen is the, uh, the barrier, isn't it? The damage absorbing shield. Just doesn't really seem to last very long, but maybe it. 
increases the the length that it yeah increase sign duration 10% it's not not long acid resistance um, Axi is the uh, the possession I think and Uridin is the um, uh, the traps Crushing blow two. Let's go. S oh no, I've done that. I've done that one already. Bloody rage two. Only works when Geralt has less than fifteen percent vitality. Uh, let's not worry about that. Sever sinews. Pain plus thirty percent. Fast steel. Group steel. Okay, let's, do, let's do group steel here. Precise hit. Um, half spin two damage. Plus 25%. Okay, so that works well. Uh, we still have the silver. Some of the silver things we need to uh, improve as well. But that should do for now. We're going to rest for two hours. And it's definitely night time now. I want to grab the swallow potion I had. Um, I did make a swallow potion. Let's, let's put this back up here. I guess I should go to the Mage's Tower and see if there's anything different. Kaltstein must be there. He might have a few, book, uh, a few books for me as well, and maybe some more information, so... Yeah, there's the, there's the Scouts. Masked Warrior. There's a named character over there as well, so it could be a, a more difficult fight. Yeah, unfortunately I don't know about this creature, so I, I can't get any remains. I'm going to have to wait for that. There's another one. Kick him a worker. Now the druid, not the druid, fool's parsley is what I need. We needed four fool's parsley leaves and uh, I've got six of them so that should be enough uh, to make the shirt. Uh, that we need to protect ourselves from the, uh, the werewolf. Okay, Capstein's here. Gate of water. Looks like he's left some, some goodies here for us. Another sugar doll. I don't want to teleport. The gate of water. Okay. Greetings, Witcher. What are you doing in this tower? Finally! I've waited so long! Kalkstein. The greatest discovery of my life! Know that you fully earned your reward. That formula needs rethinking. 
I've received 1,000 orins. Teleporting crystal has been given to Kalkstein. I've given, given, uh, given him all of his notes back. Yes? Does he have any books we haven't read? Hmm. Read everything. Can I sell him this book? No, he doesn't want it. Okay. Never mind. Yes? How goes your research? I've a new theory. A milestone in alchemy. Everything is composed of particles so small they can't be seen. Uh huh. They're constantly moving and acting upon each other. I have yet to confirm it, but I'm working on it. Um, maybe you can tell me about this later. Yes? There is the alchemist in uh, Vizima who asked me all these questions about his philosophies. And Take care. I don't really know how to answer him, but I was hoping to get uh, Kalkstein's book off of him. Um, but I guess I'm going to have to maybe use trial and error and um, see if I can get get to the, the alchemist at the workshop and he's probably got something, something he can help me with. Uh, let's have a look... Yeah, let's head over to the camp now. So back up to the north. And uh, get ready for a fairly big, big battle. Blessings of water. They all gone. Oh, here they are. There are some Scoia'tael uh, warriors. Maybe they've been captured. Are they fighting? Are they? Give them a hand. Holy moly! What the heck is going on here? That was the wrong arm. Ah! Holy crap. Okay, this is this is a tough one. This is a tough one. I need need a break here. There's a lot of them. There are a lot of these warriors here. Defend yourself. I need to take out a few of them just to make this a little bit easier. This is really, really tough. So many of them. Oh gosh, I can't get a can't get a shot off without being hit and um, put off balance here. That thing, what is that creature? Okay, my vitality is regenerating. 
Oh, this mage. This mage is tough. Let's go and take out everyone else first. And then hopefully I can take out the mage uh, after that. Okay. Okay, another one down. Nobody messes with Salamandra. Nobody. I've got to check his pockets. I don't have time to check his pockets right now. Who's that strange creature. Taking a lot of damage here. Book, move, move, move. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Die, bastard! Oh, gosh. need to wait for this vitality to replenish a little bit before I start taking out these guys again. I think the uh, the mage needs uh, maybe a quick attack, I'm not really sure. something. I think I'm bleeding actually. I might need to try a quick attack here. Yeah, quick attack works better uh, for this one. And um, Salamandra Mage. Let's take out this thing. Whatever it is. Okay, that battle was much tougher than the uh, the rest of them. Let's go and uh, put these things down. We've got a, some swords here. An illegal sword. Can I... I just want to find out what that is. Uh, let's go and uh, check all of the remains. Okay, here we go. An illegal sword. Damage minus 20%. Uh, precise, uh, precise hit and pain. The assassin's dagger, which we don't really need, but I guess I could maybe sell that. Um... I may as well grab all of the uh, the badges just in case I can sell them off somewhere a little bit a little bit later a little bit later I should say we've got the fennoweed here as well Temerian steel axe um, now where was the the main boss I definitely want to check the remains of the of the mage oh here we go werewolf's wrath contains the formula for a potion made with werewolf fur. Okay. Royal Letter of Safe Conduct. Let's grab that and the encrypted document. So a couple of quest items there. And hopefully that will give us a few other leads. Let's just go and grab the orins, pick up all the remains as well. More Fenoed. Let's go and 
grab that. Holy moly, there were so many of them. There were so many. What a tough fight. Now, I want to find the re make sure I find the remains of the... the Uh, the remains of the mage. So I'll grab all of these ones uh, over here. Oops, I didn't didn't want to grab the assassin's dagger. I do want to keep the um, keep the torch on me. Okay, I think that is pretty much it. Uh, we've cleared out this area. I need to go and read those, read those letters, and uh, find out what they what they say. We didn't actually kill this. I think I've picked up everything around here. Is there anything else? Anything else? Just some more Fenerwed, uh, and that is pretty much it. Okay, let's go and have a quick look. Uh, at these quest items here, the Royal Letter of Safe Conduct. The bearer of this document is by the will of Foltest, King of Temeria, etc., allowed to be on the streets of City of Vizima after nightfall, regardless of any regulations. He is also beyond the res restrictions applied under the state of emergency, Foltest. Now, why would the Salamandra have a Royal Letter of Safe Conduct? Um, uh, we have an encrypted document as well. I have no idea what that says, and Maybe we'll come up with uh, some some way to read that, but uh, for now, that looks like all we can do here.